Hi, my name's Ian, and welcome to our Nuffield Health HIIT workout. This workout will be 15 minutes in length. We'll be doing five rounds of three exercises, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, with no recovery in between the rounds. The intensity level is high, but please go at your own pace to make sure that you get the most out of this session. Let's get ready to train. Okay, let's get you warmed up. 30 seconds each, four exercises. Let's go. Jogging on the spot to start with. Nice and relaxed. If you want to go a little bit higher on the knees on this first round, you can. You don't need to. We're going to change in 15. This is the start of the journey. Let's keep it tight. Okay, last five seconds. Bring it down, second exercise. Reach down, rotate left, down, rotate right. Head follows your hands. Halfway through now. Good rhythm. Breathing slowly. It's just the warm up. Changing up now, we're going to do a lunge and a reach. So lunge forward, reach to the top, opposite leg, reach to the top. Again, head ideally follows your hands. Ten seconds to go. Okay, rest there. We're going left, side step, and then reach again. Side step, reach again. Ideally, your head follows your hands just to stretch out your neck. Last 10. And we're going again. All right, jogging on the spot. Round two, 30 seconds. Maybe a little bit more intensity. Bring it up. As your arms go, let's bring our arms in. Workouts on the way. 10 seconds till we change. Slow it down, get ready for the next exercise. Two, one, squat and straight. Squat and straight. If you want to change your trajectory, you can go high. I'm going to keep it in the middle. Breathing through. You can change the angle and go low as well. Little wood chop. Last five. Okay, back to our lunge and reaches. Down forward, up we go. Down forward, and go. We can add some pace here. 10 seconds of it. Drive, drive. Try and keep that technique. If you do get off balance, don't you worry about it. Last one. We're going out to the side. Ready, troop? Down, drive. Down, drive. This is the last part of our warm up. Fifteen to go. Looking up to the ceiling for those last few reps. Really reach. And relax there. We are ready. Let's train. Okay, warm up done. Let's get into the first exercise. It's going to be a racer squat. Miles is going to do the option. Off we go. Up and twist as you jump. Trying to get as much air time as you can all the way through. If you start to tire, look at that option. You're stepping, 
you're moving, you're stepping, you're moving. Last 10 seconds, here we go, and rest. Okay, the next exercise is straddles, let's get to it. Hands down, feet out, and you're going to be trying to drive one hand in, one foot in, towards that hand. Keep that pace, nice long body. As you start to tire, you can go to the option, step in and step in. Almost home dudes, almost home. Back to it, 20 seconds and we're there. Ten to go. Bring it home. Two, one, and rest for 15. Okay, straddles done. Into press up and burpees. Now we're going to press up position. Out you go. And drive up. Drive it through. Get some good air time. Keep that pace, keep that rhythm. When you start to tire, let's look at that option, which is down and up. Option, here we go. Last 10 seconds, team. Here out on the blocks. Five. And there you go. That's one round done, more to come. Great work, let's start the cool down now. Okay everyone, let's cool you down now. Onto your mats, we're gonna go into child's pose. So, knees on the mat, Hands at the front of the mat or just off the front. Sit yourselves back down. We're going for 60 seconds here. Nice deep breaths. Slowing your heart rate right down. We're going to move your right hand to your left hand on top. You should see it, feel a nice little pull into your lat, into your upper back. Just over halfway now. Right hand off, left hand goes on to right hand. Deep breaths, bring it back to center. And you're gonna slowly bring yourself up. This time round, you're gonna move your right knee in. You're gonna take it to the midpoint of your hands and you're gonna stretch that back leg back. Looking straight forward. Again, just calming yourself down after a tough workout. Make sure you reach and we change your legs. Take your leg back to four point. Left leg through. And again, nice little stretch. Working through that second 60 seconds. Deep breaths. One more, we're going to transist right into an upward dog. So knee back to four point. This time round, you're going to drop your hips to the floor. Just lean into there. If you struggle with that, what I'd like you to do is just lower yourself to the floor. And then as an easy option, drop your elbows down. And again, look forward. We're just looking for a little stretch in this tummy. Again, breathing through, just making sure you're relaxing your legs. OK, 
Okay, challenge yourself now. Just push yourself right through. If you can go, just hold this pose a little bit longer. Still breathing, just calming that foot down. Okay, I'm gonna pull you back out of that pose now. You're gonna sit either onto your bum or onto your knees. I'm gonna go onto my knees. I'm going into this last minute now. Hand down at the side, left hand down, right hand on the top of your head. Just gently stretch. Just pulling down gently on that right hand. Just thinking about that workout that you've just done, calories you've just burned. Change hands for me. I'm gonna change two more times, just again, a little bit further, then right hand up. This time, just take it a little bit further and turn your chin to the ceiling. You'll get a deeper stretch. Coming up to that last 10 seconds now. Let's do one more change. Nice neck stretch. Little chin to the ceiling if you want to stretch a little bit further. And we're done. Let's take it back to our feet. Good work, team. Thank you very much for joining us. We'll see you next time. If you'd like more home workouts, subscribe to our YouTube channel.